Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for, what is it, the 21st? The 21st, November 21st. Now, this is just an energy I'm picking up on today. I don't know who this is for. It's not going to be for everybody. I can't shuffle. We're good. Um, yeah, I don't know who this is for. I really don't. Could be for you, might not be. It's just an energy I'm picking up on. So let's just see what comes up. Like I said, I mean, I just got to point this out. It's not a private reading. This is for a general audience. So somebody's giving up. I give up. Nine of Wands reverse. I have no more strength left to fight. Release. Taking that next step. Things have been a little chaotic and disorganized. And it's time for a change. Somebody could be leaving a relationship. Ten of Cups is a completion. It's a completion. A lot of people get that mixed up. Tens are completion of something that once was, it's over. There could be a um, relationship or uh, something, a partnership. There's two people here. This could be in the family. Somebody could be moving out, moving away. Um, something could be changing in the home front. Somebody has made the decision, the Seven of Cups reverse. The decision has been made or is being made to make a change. I can't do this anymore. It's too much for me. It's overwhelming. It is. There's no more stability here. There's no more security here. No more abundance. And, you know, I feel as though we have somebody here that is wanting more emotional support. You know, I'm, I'm looking for something that is more emotionally fulfilling than where we are today. And it's a very emotional time with that Page of Cups. I feel like somebody's following their intuition. My dreams are bigger than this. Seven or seven, where seven came from? Four of Wands reverse. Yeah, I'm letting go of a commitment. Of seriously, somebody is letting go of something that they were once committed to. I can't change this. There's no more happiness here with the Four of Wands. It's like no, it's not good. Too much. It's too much. It's, I can't go back and forth like this anymore. I can't play these games. They were hanging on for the stability of it, but it looks as though they have come to the realization that it's time for some sort of completion. This is a decision to complete. It's been stalled for quite some time. And I don't have any more strength to fight. Remember, I said there was no... I can't. My strength is gone. Somebody has been reluctant to move on. Reluctant to follow their heart, reluctant to follow their intuition, but staying where they are at, staying wherever it is in the predicament that they're in has emotionally and physically um, and energetically drained them.
drained, exhausted, exhausted. I can't, I can't do this anymore. I can't do this anymore. Somebody is deciding to, you know, go head in a new direction because they're not happy. Anymore. I'm not happy. I'm not happy. It's over. Because I want the happiness back. I want real happiness. I want happily ever after. I want emotional fulfillment. I want love. I want true love. I want real love. I want that love and feeling. And the only way I'm going to get that loving feeling is to make the decision to find my strength to move on in which they have delayed and stalled for a long time. But if there's no more happiness there and there's no more stability and security, I just got I can't do that. I'm not going to not going to do it anymore. I'm I'm releasing. I'm letting go. Yes, yeah, somebody is. This is release. The devil reverse let go. Taking back my power. I'm letting go of this situation that doesn't fulfill me anymore. I'm not going to be controlled by a lie. I'm not going to live a lie with the devil reversed. I'm not taking back my power. They're in, like I said, the, their intuition has been telling them for quite some time. And I think that they have really restrained themselves. But I think we have somebody here that is now finding their confidence and their self-esteem and their willpower to take the lead. You know, I'm about to go after my dreams. She's a visionary. My dreams are true, and this is dreams as well. My dreams are bigger than this. And somebody has really been holding it in. Keeping it a secret, their true feelings. They have been going through some sort of spiritual awakening and their intuition has been really pulling them in a new direction. It's time for me to follow my passion, my dreams. I can't live this lie anymore. I can't stay here holding on to the money. Money, money. It's a lie. That's a lie. That's greed. That's ego. The devil is ruled by ego. I'm not going to let my ego drive this situation anymore. It's not about the money anymore. I'm, I can't do this I can't. I don't have any more strength, willpower, discipline to put in any more effort here. I can't. It's no longer about the money. I can't do this anymore. Yep. Somebody is seeing seeing things through different eyes, new perspective. It's like a it's like a a swift change here. It's like all of a sudden somebody gets some sort of epiphany or something and they make a decision to change their direction. Get real. And this may be a harsh reality. Because that's what she brings, a harsh reality. We, have, we definitely have somebody here that knows, they know, they know that they have to be assertive, they have to be honest, they have to be fair, 
They have to follow their dreams. They have to follow their passions. They have to follow their intuition. They have to make that decision. And they have to move in a new direction in which they were too weak to do that in the past. You know, they didn't have the courage to do it. But it looks like we have a we have somebody here now that is deciding. To follow their intuition, to listen. Deciding to be honest with themselves. Somebody has, has made the decision. To be honest. To tell it like it is. This is what it is. I can't do this. I can't. I don't have any more energy for this. I know it. You know it. So yeah, somebody is taking back control releasing a situation that no longer serves them. I mean, I can't live this lie. I can't live this lie anymore. I'm taking the power. That's the sword of power in her hand. Somebody is taking back their power to follow their dreams, to get the love that they dream about. That's what this is about. Yep, making a conscious change. The Ten of Wands reverse. Somebody has made the decision that it's time for a change. I can't carry this burden. I can't carry these responsibilities. I can't. It's overwhelming. I'm dropping it. It's, I'm done. I've held it in. And I've held back. And we're at the point where I can't, I can't hold it anymore. I can't do it anymore. It's time. It's time for a change. We have somebody here that is finding, is finding their confidence to drop it, to drop something, to stop playing this, this game. I can't. Yeah, I'm walking away. Eight of Cups, I'm done. I'm, I'm walking away. Goodbye. There's no more emotional fulfillment here at all. I don't want, I don't want to. My, my visions of the future are so much bigger than this. And now I have to go after what I deserve. I need balance. I need harmony. So I feel like somebody is walking away to give a gift to themselves, you know, to bring balance back to their lives. Maybe they're doing it to bring balance back to the other people's life, the family or whatever it is. The, and this is like, I mean, this is kind of like the justice card. You see the scales it is in the minor arcana. It's like, this is the right thing to do. Somebody has to walk away to bring balance back to probably everybody involved. I mean, we have a family dynamic here. Whoever it is. Somebody has made the decision to. The nine to the ten. The nine. Let go. Release. Done. I can't. No. It's too heavy. I can't do this anymore. Goodbye. I mean this is pretty clear cut isn't it? Breaking free. Absolutely, somebody is breaking free because their dreams are bigger than this. Whatever is happening is bringing a new opportunity for love, which is what this person is looking for.
I can't, I can't pretend. Somebody has been staying stuck for quite some time, letting their themselves be trapped. Waiting for somebody to come untie them, waiting for somebody to come and help them when they had to do it themselves. They may have been staying where they're at to protect the family or somebody or protect somebody because this is like protection. It really is. But it looks like they're about to break free. She's got the sword in her hand now and she's about to take that mask off. Cut that tie. And accept the truth of whatever this is. A decision has been made to break free from something that has no more growth. I mean, there's no growth here. So yeah, somebody is making a decision to move in a new direction. I mean, I can't I can't pretend that this is anything different. Let's get one of these cards. We haven't used them in a while. Let's get an oracle card. Somebody is breaking free from a toxic situation. That was is based on some sort of lie. It is. I mean, I can't I can't pretend that this is anything else. And they're headed towards a new opportunity in love. Starting over in love. That's what this is a page, starting over. Maybe you've already walked away and you have this new offer because after walking away at the very end, there is a new opportunity for love. So for some of you that have already walked away, there's a new opportunity for love. Nature and release. I mean, the cards speak for themselves. If you're, if you are feeling ungrounded or you're feeling uneasy, this is saying that you need to, you need to get out there and. Get in touch with nature. I mean, that's what it says. Follow your bliss. It's like, if you think about nature, wind just came to mind. And with the Queen of Swords, I mean, it's like air. It's like, yeah. The winds of change. That's what this is. It's a time to release what no longer serves you. And that's what's going on. It is what it is. I, don't, I can't do this anymore. I'm letting this go. Now, like I said, I don't know who this reading is for. It will not be for every single person. It's not for me. And I'm fine with that. It's for somebody. I don't know who. Whoever needs it. Whoever needs this reading is going to be drawn to this reading. To watch it right up to this point.
I just look up that nature card and see what it says. I mean, it basically says get outside and breathe. Yeah, it doesn't say anything really. I mean, it just says a bunch of stuff about getting outside and enjoying nature. Deepen your affinity with nature. That's what it says. So maybe that's what you got to do. I don't know. As far as I'm concerned, this is a day of, of giving up on a situation that was some sort of lie or evil or uh, unhealthy, an unhealthy situation. I'm done. I can't. That's what this is. Somebody has stalled and the time is now. Goodbye.